ಸಮುಧೋ ಜಾನತಿ ಪುರುಷೋತ್ತಮ ಸರ್ವಿಂದ ಭಜತಿ ಮಾಂ ಸರ್ವಭಾವೇನ ಭಾರತ ದಟ್ ದಿವೋಟಿ ಹೂ ನೋಸ್ ಅಂಡ್ ಅಂಡರ್ಸ್ಟ್ಯಾಂಡ್ಸ್ ಮೀ ಅಂಡ್ ಹ್ಯಾವ್ ನೋ ಡೌಟ್ ಅಬೌಟ್ ಮೀ that devotee alone can serve me with all their heart and soul and might this is a creation of lord krishna in the bhagavad gita that if you have any doubt about god you cannot really serve him to remove any doubt about god you have to purify your heart completely om narayana ay krishna ay govinda ay namo namah he krishna karuna sindhu din bandhu jagatpati gopi sha gopi ka kanta radha kanta namaste to remove the doubt in your heart my friends you have to purify your heart and the first way to purify your heart is to give up the self me me mine self love because god himself is not a selfish god like the sun the mighty sun the eye and face of god supreme of a billion suns he gives us light and heat and water and food and energy and comfort and he acts for nothing he is the embodiment of pure love one conditional on selfish universal love unless we give up selfish love me me mine and turn to god and say thee thee thine o lord everything belongs to you nothing belongs to us we can enjoy the earth and enjoy the fruits of the earth that you have given by honesty and integrity in our work and by perfection in discipline duty knowledge and devotion using our particular talent to sharpen it educate it and produce goods of quality and uh, excellence in service and in goods it is this aspect of religion that has been left out and the poverty in the world affects billions of people because we give a little charity and we forget to understand that we have to be perfect in our work and our duty so that we can be become self supporting with our self sufficiency and self support and self effort we can remain in poverty so instead of just giving charity we should make an effort to enable the poor to use their talents to produce goods of service of quality 
and excellence. They should learn to dig a well. They should learn what to do in an emergency. They should know what to do in drought, what to do in a flood or famine, what to do if there is an external aggressive effort by other entities. These are the basic things that every citizen should learn and government must encourage the youth to serve with a national youth corps or international youth corps to spend time to serve their fellow men. Because by serving your fellow men and asking for nothing, you are acting like the God himself who doesn't want anything. He is the embodiment of pure love. It is only through pure love that we can know God and have no doubt about God. Because if we have any doubt about God and do not experience Him in our heart, we remain like animals. Me, me, mine. Me, me, mine. With lust, anger, greed, harshness, ignorance, arrogance. People are suffering every day, my friends, every day with cancer, heart disease and stroke, with loss of life and limb. with divorce and drugs and losses in this stock market and losses through fighting and through going to jail. My dear friends, the earth has enough food to feed the whole world. But today we have nuclear weapons and space weapons and weapons under the sea. Mankind has gone crazy and want to destroy this planet with the next world war. Lord Krishna is saying, only through pure love, only through understanding who I am, that I am the best gift, that God has given us the best gifts of himself and through good works, by doing good things without seeking any reward, the Lord knows what you need before you open your mouth. My dear friends, if you want to follow the path of truth and light, you must seek God diligently with all your heart and soul and might and have no doubt about God. Associate with people who love God. Read the scriptures and try to understand it. Bow down to the mighty sun every day and say, O oh God, you are the embodiment of your love. You are the symbol of the mighty Lord of a billion sons. I bow down to you. And the Lord will bless you and show you the light. Because the sun, the mighty sun, is pure light. Let us bow down to that mighty sun and to the Lord of a billion suns and pray to him that he can cleanse our heart and rid it of selfish love and whatever we gain by our honest effort and our goods we must share. We must learn to love, to give, to share, to care, to be less selfish, to be more generous, but to be always in control of our mind and heart, our appetites and our stomach and our procreative energy. My dear friends, because of the lack of self-control, every day we see the havoc of drugs and alcohol and cigarettes and the mighty bubble of Babylon, the TV that shows only the dark side of humanity. 
I call upon the teachers of the world to rise up above selfish gods, primitive gods, vampire gods, dishonest gods, gods that want you to kill in his name when he has all the power. Gods that are jealous, gods that love only one particular nation and doesn't love others. My dear friends, it is time in the 21st century to rise above selfish love and selfish nationhood and rise up to serve all mankind with pure love, the example of the mighty sun and the mighty God of a billion sons. Om, Om, Om. God bless all those who are listening to this uh, video. Thank you very much.